Well, hello everyone, and good evening. I'm uh, William Brantley from the uh, Bemis, South Jackson, Tennessee area, uh, ready to report today's uh, climate summary and give you a forecast for the next nine days here in just a few moments. It turned out to be a very gorgeous, beautiful uh, Sunday afternoon, uh, November the 13th, 2016 today. Uh, the temperature got up to 68 degrees for a high today. Normal high is 63, so we were a little above normal. A uh, low this morning was a chilly, frosty uh, 30 degrees. It did get below freezing this morning. And we did have uh, frost on the ground and several other surfaces as well. Uh, we will probably have another frost again tomorrow morning. We've had no rainfall, of course, for... Uh, November, or uh, today weather, and we've had uh, 15 hundreds for the month of November so far. And uh, other than that, uh, the highest wind gust today was out of the east at 7 miles per hour, and that was at about 11 a.m. At 4 p.m. today, this evening, the sky was uh, clear. The temperature at that time was 42 degrees. As of 5.18 p.m., the temperature has dropped down to uh, 52 degrees. So it's dropped 10 degrees in just one hour and 20 minutes, roughly. Uh, the uh, dew point at 4 p.m. was 40 degrees. The uh, relative humidity was 43%. And the winds are calm. And the barometric pressure was standing at 30.16 inches of mercury at 4 p.m. Now, today's lowest humidity was 37% at 2 and 3 p.m., while the highest was uh, 95% at 7 a.m. early this morning. And uh, to, tonight's, uh, today, well, <laughs> the sun will rise tomorrow morning since it's already gone uh, for uh, this evening at uh, 6.30 tomorrow morning. The moon is already up as well. And it should be setting tomorrow morning at 5.08 a.m. And speaking of the moon, it's going to be completely full tomorrow night. It's 99.9% .9 full tonight, I guess. <laughs> you could call it that. Uh, and the moon's going to be rising uh, tomorrow evening at 5.24 p.m. And setting uh, Tuesday morning at 6.20 a.m. But it's going to be a little extra special tonight and tomorrow night because it's going to be uh, a little brighter and a little bit bigger since uh, its uh, orbit around the uh, Earth is a little closer uh, this time around than it usually is. So it should be a beautiful moonlit sky tonight and uh, tomorrow night as well. Uh, that leads to tonight's forecast of uh, mostly clear skies. The temperature should drop down to about 32 degrees. It might hit 31 in some locations, but here about 32. The high tomorrow should be about 67 with southwest winds at 5 to 15 miles per hour. On uh, Tuesday, it should be continued fair with a low near 40 and a high of 70 with west winds at 10 to 20. On Wednesday, it's going to be continued mostly fair with a low near 40, again, a high of about 73 with southwest winds at 5 to 10. And on uh, Thursday, it's going to be mostly fair with a low near 44 and a high of 76 with south winds at 10 to 20. And on Friday, it now looks like it's going to be generally fair almost all day, all the way to sunset. And then by Friday night, we have a 60% uh, chance for some rain to move in. And uh, that will last until uh, sunrise Saturday morning. So now looks like uh, Friday night and Saturday morning we have a chance for rain in our area. Hopefully that will hold up. Because we do need the rain real bad around here. We're getting so dry and all. Uh, see, the low for Friday should be about 49. The high should be about 73. So temperatures are going to be pretty decent despite uh, the rain for Friday night. But we should have... a a um, fair amount of sunshine during the daylight hours, though. The wind should be out of the south at about 15 to 30, so it'll be a little windy on Friday also. And uh, like I mentioned, on Saturday, it's going to be mostly cloudy till sunrise with a 
about a 40% chance of rain till sunrise, then it's going to become uh, mostly fair for the remainder of Saturday. With a low near 42 and a high of only 55, so it'll be kind of cool Saturday afternoon, next Saturday afternoon. And with northwest winds at 15 to 25, it's going to be almost chilly even for the afternoon. Anyways, and that leads to next Sunday, mostly fair skies, with a low near 28, a high of 51, and uh, that's pretty chilly for a high, sort of. Uh, we'll have north winds at 10 to 20, and then uh, next Monday week, the 21st, should be mostly fair, with a low near 25. Woo, it's going to get on down there a little bit. 25 degrees, that'd be almost considered a hard freeze if it gets down that cold with a high of only 54, with north winds at 10 to 20. So it looks like uh, uh, next next Sunday and Monday is going to be nippy-nippy, <laughs> if I can use that kind of language. All right, uh, uh, Tuesday week, the 22nd, is going to be mostly fair skies, continuing with low about 32 and a high of about 60. And uh, that's a look at your forecast all the way through uh, next Tuesday week, the 22nd. Uh, so, uh, looks like some colder weather is coming in for about two or three days, uh, toward next weekend. Well, look forward to that, I think. I don't know, that's getting kind of chilly for me, but you know it's coming. We're going into that season, but, oh well, we'll have to deal with it. And wrap up and do the best you can to stay warm next weekend when that time comes. Well, alrighty, that's it for tonight. I, uh, hope all of you have a pleasant Sunday night. And I hope you wake up to a beautiful Monday morning, uh, at which time I hope to have, of course, another weather video update for you. And until then, good night, my friends. Have a pleasant night and sweet dreams. And God bless. Talk to you tomorrow morning.